The light shines in the darkness, and the darkness has not overcome it. Pray with us during Advent prayer time on Thursday evenings, a time of collective common prayer from our homes. It's good to be together in prayer this evening. In the midst of a divisive world, in a time of noise and bluster and anxiety and uncertainty, we take a moment to pray, to let the noise subside, to offer our prayers, to be silent, to be in conversation with our Creator, and remember that our Creator created the world in goodness. We pray together from our homes this evening, not alone, but as a community, both speaking and listening. We bring different backgrounds and ideas, but we agree that God hears our prayers and that God acts. So together this evening, let us pray for our world, for our community. Let us pray for those we said that we would pray for. To begin our prayers, hear God's presence in the words of the psalm for this Sunday. It's Psalm 34, and I'll read verses 1 through 10 and finish with verse 22. I will bless the Lord at all times. The praise of God shall ever be in my mouth. I will glory in the Lord. Let the lowly hear and rejoice. Proclaim with me the greatness of the Lord. Let us exalt God's name together. I sought the Lord who answered me and delivered me from all my terrors. Look upon the Lord and be radiant and let not your faces be ashamed. I called in my affliction and the Lord heard me and saved me from all my troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who fear the Lord and delivers them. Taste and see that the Lord is good. Happy are they who take refuge in God. Fear the Lord, you saints of the Lord, for those who fear the Lord lack nothing. The lions are in want and suffer hunger, but those who seek the Lord lack nothing that is good. O Lord, you redeem the life of your servants, and those who put their trust in you will not be punished. Here ends the psalm. So a start to our prayers this evening. Let us pray. Merciful God, open my heart and mind to be fully present this evening and also this coming day and the days ahead. Allow me to listen to others without passing judgment or haste to solve what I cannot change. Give me patience and understanding and grant me grace in my own shortcomings. Be with me in times of fatigue, and lift me up this evening with the strength to share your compassionate love with all those I pray for, with all those I meet. In Christ's name we pray. Amen. So together we offer our prayers this evening. <laughs> 